doesn't like a good music festival. This one is called Outside Lands Music Festival in the heart of San Francisco's Golden Gate Park. You know, it's not always easy, though, to attend events like this. You've got parking, deal with the crowds, plus they can be expensive. Well, what if you could experience something like this from the comfort of your own living room? Super stoked on it. I think it'd be awesome. Welcome to the world of live webcast production. This is what we do every day. Live broadcasting has moved beyond the TV news into a whole new world. Anyone in China, in Europe, United States, in Africa, anyone with internet connection and a PC or a mobile device can watch this content live. That's what this technology does. Mayo Babbitt is president and CEO of iStream Planet, a company that produces online streaming video of live events. Anything from a sporting events, music events, uh, corporate communications, product launches. And you can watch it all free, live, as it's happening. Streaming is not a new technology, but the way it's being done now sure is. One producer contracting with iStream Planet says the industry has transformed in a blink. Technology is moving so fast now. It was only three years and three months ago that we shot the first performance video that one could ever get on iTunes. And that seems like a lifetime away compared to what we're doing now. And what they're doing now takes an amazing array of complex steps. We got to look not from far away, but behind the scenes at San Francisco's giant Outside Lands concert. A tour of the production truck gave us an idea how many people come together to manage the technology. This is webcast control. This is truly the heart of the entire operation. All the feeds are back here, all of our outputs, whether it's TV, streaming, various special feeds of screens throughout the festival, everything is coming in and out of here. You have a lot of people. We have a lot of people, a lot of signals that are going on at once. We're putting out multiple program feeds at the same time. And you can watch this action from seven stages and more than 29 cameras in high def on any device that gives you internet access. Can you say convenient? What if you could watch an event like this, live streaming video from home? Well, that would be fantastic. I mean, that would be great. We wouldn't have to walk three miles to go back this way to get our ticket. That would be awesome. It's the power of internet and a broadcast over the internet. There's no limitations. And that's good news, despite the economic downturn. Contrary to the opinion that the economy may be hurting our industry, our industry is booming because of the economy taking a downturn. It costs more and more money to travel, and so whether it be entertainment or an enterprise event, live streaming is getting more and more popular. It's a technology that used to be simply called webcasting, but now managed webcasting gives companies like iStream Planet a much bigger role in productions they deliver. Here in San Francisco, AT&T is footing the bill. The company hired iStream once it secured the digital rights from the performers. Babbitt points out that iStream not just produces the show, which includes elaborate behind-the-scenes equipment, it also handles the content acquisition, encoding, delivery, and integration with the customer's website. But those are details some don't care to bother with. I mean, you could experience an event like this like on your iPod or on your phone or at your home computer. Would you do it? Yes. It's a great idea. Would you watch it? Of course.